court in Bloomfield. When I know very well that they were not present in any of these issues that are in the in indictment, the people that are being protected by the investigating team are very clearly known. I have more than enough evidence to prove that this thing is much more than just an average people that are working at, at, at an institution called G4S that just decided on one day to release me. It's highly impossible for them to do that without political power, with other high office involved in this issue. I have been out in South Africa living my life for a year. I have not violated any human. But I am treated with the utmost, even in the legal fraternity, Your Honor. It's very difficult for me to appoint an attorney. Attorney would cancel brief on the base that say, I don't want to be associated with Tabo Besta because the media will attack me. I've had five counsels who told me that, that I would love to be in your case, but I'll be in the background because I cannot be seen in front because you're Tabo Besta. The media will destroy me and the, the state will never give me any work. Is that anyhow how I should be treated when I am standing in trial, Your Honor? Is that equal to any other person that is standing in trial? My last point, Your Honor, is that under this Section is, This 15, is your third last point. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's make it a, 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 This is the last point. Yes. Okay. <laughs> section two, section two hundred and, uh, 277 that was cancelled by the Constitutional Court as a death sentence. Your Honor, I say this as a broken man, and I say this wholeheartedly. It tears me apart to see these people in this court knowing very well that they're suffering for something they know, not, know nothing about. I request that the public, if they are so convinced, and if the prosecution is so convinced that I am the waste of these people's lives, that this section be enforced on a, panel, or on a, on a petition, that under, special, un, under the previous Act of Correctional Services, I mean of, of Criminal Pros, uh, Prosecution, Act 126 of 92. Of I have been forced to dress as such. I am not dressed. These clothes were bought for a purpose to come to court. I had to spend money to look like this. I have clothes in, 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 in my bags that have whatever branding. I am not allowed to wear clothes that cost a certain amount. I was told that I, can, I, I can't wear clothes that are Louis Vuitton or whatever because it gives the wrong impression. So I am now being forced to follow laws based on an impression, Your Honor. And this is not just one thing, it's several matters and several issues that lead to one person. And this is one person out of 300,000 inmates in South Africa.